Hi folks, hope you all, all are doing great. I, Ravarinjan Samantrai, with my partner Niti Segde of Eagle Batch, came up with this video to demonstrate our final project of the course. From September 2019, we both are learning full stack development, where we came across different technology like JavaScript, Node.js, Express.js, React.js, and MongoDB. So, as this is our final project, thus, we have applied all those learning into one and came up with this idea. The idea is to make an e-commerce website th through which we can help people in this lockdown or in a problematic situation to buy their essentials. And also, we got to apply all our learning as well as new things that we came across the internet. So, let's just start with the demonstration. This is our landing page. As you can see, there are product listed all around. Thus, when we move the mouse cursor to one of the product, you can see a add to cart button is there so that a user can add the product to the cart. Uh, uh, this is not opening, right? This is happening because uh, we have made our cart inaccessible till the user got logged in to the website. So let's just go to login page. Now we can see a product is there in, a, in the cart which we have added before. So now let's just go to the product page and add some more product. Now we are adding more products to our cart. So let's just add this one. Okay, now let's go to cart. Okay, we can see right now we have three products. So let's just go to the product page and add more items to the cart. Yep. Now let's just go to the cart page and uh, delete some item. Okay. Now let's just go to the checkout button. Okay. Uh, here we have used PayPal checkout uh, because it it's uh, one of the best in the market to use the API for checking out of the product or payment method of the listed product. Yeah, one more thing. This one is also built in mobile responsive. So you can enjoy it in your mobile too. So let's just talk about technologies we have used here. In the front end, uh, we use React.js along with Bootstrap for responsive and custom CSS for styling. And in the back end, we have used Node.js as JavaScript runtime, in which we have used Express.js, Bcrypt, Ex Express Validator, JSON Web Token. And for the database, we have used MongoDB Atlas. With this, we came up to end this video. Once again, I, Prabhupadan Samantrai, and my partner Niti Sehgde, signing off from this project demonstration. Hope you all enjoyed. Thank you all. Thank you, Atenio.